Hey there, Louis Acabellis here. Thanks for stopping by. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can delete a record from a table in Airtable. Now, before we get started, if you find this tutorial helpful, please hit that thumbs up below and be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest tutorials that I publish. Now let's go ahead and let's get started. All right, now there are a few different ways that you can delete records in Airtable. Now the first way that you can delete a record is to just hover your cursor over the particular record or row that you want to delete. So if I place my cursor over this new docking station record here and I right click on my mouse, this is going to bring up a menu and you can see at the very bottom, it says delete record. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that and you can see that that record has been deleted. Now very quickly, if I wanted to undo that, I can just go ahead and click this undo button and that's going to restore the record. Now the other way that you can delete records from a table in Airtable is you can actually click into the record by placing your cursor on this expand record button and clicking on it. And this is going to bring up the form or card view for your records. Now from here, if you place your cursor on the more options button and click on it, this is going to bring up another menu again and you can see at the very bottom of this menu is a delete record option. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on this and you can see here that the record has been deleted. Now just a quick bonus, again, if you wanna undo the changes, you can go ahead and click on the undo button and that's going to restore your record. But what's really cool about Airtable is it also features a recycle bin that you can use to view things that you've deleted and actually restore them. So if I wanted to go ahead and restore that record that I just deleted, I can go ahead and scroll to the very top of the Airtable interface and I can click on this trash bin icon. Doing so is going to bring up a recycling bin where you can actually see all of the different things that you've deleted within the last seven days. So that's a really important note that items will only stay in this recycle bin for seven days. After seven days, then the recycle bin will be sort of emptied uh, and you won't be able to restore anything that's been deleted past seven days. Now you can see in this list, it says you deleted a record from invoice register. You can see that new docking station record that I just deleted. If I wanted to go ahead and restore this, all I need to do is click on this restore button you can see here restored. And if I click out of the trash bin, you can see here record number four, new docking station has been added back into my table. Now that's how you can delete an individual record. Let's say you wanted to go ahead and delete multiple records from your base. What you want to do is you want to place your cursor at the very left of the record that you wanna delete. And you wanna go ahead and check that box that appears so you can see here, I'm checking multiple records. And now that I've selected these items, if I wanna delete them, now I just wanna go ahead and right click on any one of those records. And you can see here that the menu option now reads delete all selected records. So if I go ahead and click on this, all three of those records have been deleted. And again, if I wanted to revert that change, I could click undo, or I can just click on the trash bin icon uh, and you can see here, I deleted three records. And if I click restore, I can revert those records and have them added back into the table. So that's it. In this tutorial, I showed you multiple ways that you can delete an individual record or multiple records from a table in Airtable. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please hit that thumbs up below and be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest tutorials that I publish. I'm Louis Acabellas. Thanks for stopping by. Talk soon.